Welcome to the BirdData video tutorial recording a survey with a mobile app. Firstly, you must download the BirdData app in Google Play or the Apple Store. Links for the app can be found on the BirdData website birddata.birdlife.org.au. At the website, hover over Download App and select either the Apple Store or Google Play icon. Once installed, you must sign in using your BirdData username and password. If you haven't signed up for Bird Data, click Create a New Account, which will redirect you to the registration page. Alternatively, visit support.birdlife.org.au forward slash portal to sign up. For help with the sign up process, you can check out our video tutorial, Registering for Bird Data. Once you've logged in, click Record Survey. Next, you must select the location of your survey. You may search for a site or location with the search bar, or if you're currently near the location, press the location button on the right. Previously surveyed sites will appear as blue dots, and shared sites will appear as purple polygons. By clicking the settings icon, you may select a map or satellite view to assist identifying your survey location. Press and hold on the map to select your survey location. You'll be prompted on the accuracy of the survey point. Select the most appropriate option. Next you'll see the detail screen. Enter the start date, start time and change the survey program if required. Next you'll need to enter the survey type. If you are unfamiliar with the survey type options, please see our survey techniques guide which can be accessed at birddata.birdlife.org.au forward slash help. Next, enter the survey duration. This may be left blank if you are currently recording the survey. You also have the option of naming the location of the survey in this menu. Finally, adjust the number of observers if necessary and add any other comments to the record. Click record sightings to continue. To add a species to your survey, search for the species observed by scrolling through the species list or by typing the common species name. If you are familiar with four letter bird codes, these may also be used. Select the species observed. Next to count, enter the number of individuals that are observed for the species. Otherwise, leave blank and the species will be recorded as present. If breeding activity was observed for the species, click on none and select the relevant supporting behavior or observations. Notes for the species may also be added here. If you select a species that's outside its estimated range, you'll be prompted to ensure you have selected the correct species. You should also include any features of the bird you used for identification in the notes section. To delete a species record, click on the species, press back to remove the keyboard, and click delete sighting. For people recording while they survey, you can increase and decrease the observation count for each species with the plus and minus buttons. Once you've completed your species record, click the review and submit button. If you did not record the survey duration in the details tab, you may be prompted by the app to use the time elapsed since starting the survey as the survey duration. After ensuring the details are correct, click submit survey. Surveys submitted by the Bird Data mobile app can be edited through the Bird Data web portal. The Bird Data web portal can be accessed at birddata.birdlife.org.au. For more information on the Bird Data portal and mobile app, please see our other tutorial videos and supporting user guides at birddata.birdlife.org.au forward slash help.